Hello and welcome to Jumble Tips. I'm Countacula and today I will be showing you how to install and run mCreator 1.7.2 for your Windows PC. mCreator does have a download available for Linux and Macintosh users, but I will not be covering that subject in this tutorial. Please like, comment and request below. Now, let us continue. After clicking the link in the description, you will be brought to an AdFly page, and after waiting 5 seconds, you will have the option to skip the advertisement. Skip the advertisement, and you will be brought to a completely blank page with the mCreator zip file downloading. I recommend that you use Google Chrome for this process, purely due to its faster internet download speed. After this is downloaded, I assume, I predict approximately 4 to 15 minutes of download time, depending on your computer and internet, you will find it in your downloads folder and drag it to your desktop. After dragging it to your desktop, you can you have three options you can either open it as a winrar you can either extract it on your desktop like this or you can extract it into a folder on your desktop i'm going to extract it on my desktop if you do not know how to extract a uh, a zip file into a folder then please refer to my StarCraft video and, we, and that will show you how. It is now extracting mCreator onto my desktop and then I will show you from there. The extraction has been completed and you have these two readme files. There is a Windows readme and there is a Linux readme. The Windows readme reads To run mCreator you need to be an administrator. Then open it by clicking on mCreator.exe or mCreator.bat but you will not have that option if you open it or extract all the files onto your desktop or in a folder. You only get that when you open it in WinRAR. So, as the README told us to do, we will open the mCreator.exe file or the application, and the PyloP mCreator launcher will now pop up. Thank you for watching. I have been Countacula of TumbleTips. Please like, comment and subscribe. Goodbye.